Hiya, Matt here for my fifth video, I think. <clears throat> Got a little bit of free time on my hands. <clears throat> so I thought I'll, um, I'll have a quick smoke on whatever is in this box. It's my new cigar box. Uh, it's the Diego number 10. <clears throat> Pour myself a nice coffee. If you hear any background noise guys, the missus is getting her stuff ready for work and the young gun has not long got back from work, so excuse the noise, I'm trying to chip off here and have a bit of quiet time. Mm. Alright then, let's get this thing started shall we? And while I'm doing this, if you're watching this and you like my material, I've done some other videos, I'm really new to this. <coughs> uh, like and subscribe, Cigar Moments with Matty, yes. <coughs> Follow my journey on trying lovely cigars. <coughs> so I'm on my own today. <coughs> <coughs> Terrible cough. So I'm going to be a little bit more quiet on this one and I'm just going to just enjoy the smoke. What are we going to choose? Oh, excuse me, it's not good. <clears throat> oh, that's the thought. I haven't got my cutter so I'll have to use the punch. <clears throat> um Tried these. I'm not going to smoke the Maradona number ten. That looks a really, really nice cigar. So I'm not going to, not going to bother with that one. That's going to be more of a special one. I want to go for a shorter one, I reckon. The Diego number ten. Lovely cigar box that is. Uh -uh. So I'm going to go with the Cohiba Siglo 1 <clears throat> Perla. Let's have a look at this. It's a small cigar. Oh, okay, that's comparison to a Robusto. Let's have a look at the Monte, Monte Cristo. Hmm, see? Inch, inch and a half. <coughs> Oh, feeling a bit rough. Let's get this all put in. Being a small cigar, I may, I may pin this is not going to take as long to smoke. Let's try this coffee. We've been out cycling today. <clears throat> Took the missus out. Mine's down, being cleaned. Strip down. <clears throat> right. Get something going, I'll give you my verdict. Probably my eighth cigar I've done. It's my fifth video. You know what guys, I really like making cigars. I didn't think I'd do it, it's really new to me. Mm. 
<laughs> I haven't had a bad cigar yet. If you're watching this, right, and you want to make a comment, let me know of some bad cigars <clears throat> so I can avoid them. But if you watch my other videos, I've like labelled them what I've been smoking, and all of them have been good. And this is good as well. So relaxing. Tastes so nice. It's smooth. There's hardly any difference in the, a, there is a difference in the cigars I've been smoking, but not massively. They're all really nice, creamy, chocolatey, kind of a woody. It's crazy as it sounds, guys, but you know, it's a cigar and it's a tobacco leaf, multiple tobacco leaves, and it doesn't taste tobacco y. All the cigars I've smoked haven't really tasted tobacco -y. They've been really, almost having a really creamy, lovely coffee, uh, creamy chocolate, uh, with a hint of like walking through woodland and you've got that woody, got that woody uh, type of taste. The, the, the notes in the cigar are quite woody. Yeah, that's nice. That is nice. I like it. I like it. The Cohiba Siglo one Perla. It's got Perla in brackets. I'm not quite sure sure what all that means, but I thought I thought I'd tell you what exactly is on the label when I brought this. Cheers, guys. I'm just going to sit back and enjoy the cigar. I like the idea of this uh, cigar smoking, guys, because, you know, you're not taking it back into your lungs. It's a nice flavoured taste what you get in your mouth. It's relaxing. It's a nice smell. It's a lovely aroma. It's, in, it's It chills you out. And it's not going, the way I feel about it, it's not going into your lungs. <clears throat> okay, it might get a little bit going, you know, it might get a little bit. No more than getting fumes in your lungs when you're cycling down the road or walking down the road from, you know, from vehicles. <clears throat> so I'm going to enjoy this. I'm going to stop this and I want to get into end of the layer, the first quarter, get into the half and then I'll... Uh, I'll come back to you and let you know how I'm getting on. So, I'll uh, back in a second. See you in a minute. Right. I've uh, restarted the video a little bit earlier than I wanted to. I just had a great idea, which I haven't done yet. So, I spoke, I uh, smoked about seven, seven to eight cigars now. I've done, this is my fifth video. Um, but, I've just been into the cupboard and some leftover from Christmas. Um, little bottles. I've got whiskey, uh, some white McKay blended Scotch whiskey. Okay, it's not single malt. Sorry about that, but not well. Um. So let's. I've just poured a little bit out onto a spoon, and I want to put the end in. Come on to the end. Uh, where are you? Makes it a bit more interesting. Mmm, nice. Got a little bit of a whiskey flavour to it now. So I'm going to enjoy this a bit more then, I'll be back to you. Back in a sec guys. 
Welcome back. <coughs> right then, getting into the into the half of the cigar now because we're entering it now. It's a lovely, it's a lovely, lovely smoke. So if you're new to this, guys, and you've been watching my channel, <coughs> all the cigars have been smoking really nice. There's only been a couple on there that have marked four out of five. I'm marking this five out of five. It's a lovely smoke. It's smooth. It's not harsh at all. It's really mild. It's got a nice gauge to it. The baby cigar. But it burns at a decent pace. Get a good draw on it. It's a lovely taste. You will not be disappointed in this cigar if you're in a raw one. And it's, still, it's called the, the uh, Cohiba Siglo One Perla. Perla in brackets. P E R L A. Yeah, so I dropped a little bit of whiskey on the end. It's okay. I suppose it's a little bit gimmicky, really. Ain't too bad. Something I probably won't do that often. You know what? I'll soon have a nice coffee and a nice bit of chocolate with a cigar. Compliments it just nice. Just nice. Lovely, lovely. So, as well, I want to ask you is in the comments below, tell me what cigars to try. You know, don't and don't go saying try this, try that, which cost you know over hundreds of pounds for a cigar. I'm not. I'm too green behind the ears to have cigars like that just yet. Well, if you want to be kind enough, in the comments below, send me some, send me some cigars to try, and I'll give you a shout out. <clears throat> so this is going to be a short video, guys. Um, I want to knock it on the head now, so thank you for watching. <clears throat> uh, check out my upcoming videos, there's going to be more. I've got cigars to smoke in this box, I've got some on order, uh, I've got some back at my house. Um, yeah, so more videos to come. Um, uh, my little journey into cigar smoking. Try and be straight if I'm honest with you, I don't know too much but I'm just trying to, you know, if you're new to it just like me then I might give you some insight. <clears throat> But the ones I've had so far, can't lose, can't lose. Some of them might be a little bit too long to smoke, you know. You know, you come up to an hour, so you start chugging on it a little bit more, just to make it burn, so you're not sitting there. You know, I suppose you'd be there for an hour and a half. Don't mind a cigar, but I don't want to be sitting there for an hour and a half. Unless I've got company and I'm in a cigar lounge, which I really want to try. I want to be somewhere where it's nice and warm, you know, casual smoke with like-minded people, Enjoying a cigar. I listen to people's stories, you know, their, their um, experience with cigars and, and whatnot. Everything to do with cigars, smoking, you know, cigar lounges, shops, buying, uh, the quality, the smoking, whatnot. Lovely cigar. It's come up to 15 minutes. A little bit short video than my normal ones. <clears throat> I'm on my own. Not much to talk about really. Just having a quiet smoke with this little little baby right here. So yeah, thanks for watching. <clears throat> take care. Like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, take care guys. Until next time. See you later.